our, our first official spring in 2021 weather forecast, uh, including the months March, April, and May. So this will be he he second spring fall f- spring forecast. But although we did a pre- me- for another forecast, it was actually just a preliminary one. So this will be a, an official forecast. So I want to make sure you guys like this this video or for and other videos for more weather related content. Subscribe to the channel for more. All right, now we're gonna go with the to the temperature forecast. There is this temp, this country will be expected to be above average in terms of temperatures, except the northwest corner, which includes Washington State and even Seattle, with the rest of the country dealing with above normal temperatures, particularly in the south, where cities like Oklahoma City and Phoenix and Houston could get at way above normal te- above t- temperatures, and then many. The major cities will be in the orange, such as San Francisco, Los Angeles, Salt City, Lake City, Denver, Kansas City, Sioux Falls, Minneapolis, Chicago, Nashville, Atlanta, Tampa, Cleveland, Washington, D.C., New York City, and Boston. Now the now the now there will be some slightly above normal temperatures for the northern tier of the U.S. As but otherwise we're going to be mostly dealing with some above normal temperatures. Now here's the spring 2021 precipitation forecast. Some po- some of the Great Lakes and Pacific Northwest will be above normal in terms of precipitation. Cities include Minneapolis, Chicago, and Seattle, and then, and then southern and western portions of the country will be dealing with below normal precipitation, which includes Los Angeles, Phoenix, Denver, Oklahoma City, Houston, and Tampa. And then the rest of the country will be seeing near normal temperatures. But this will be kind of just, this is just the first forecast. And we're still about like two months from the first day of spring. So this is really just kind of, of going to be changing for the next X, X couple of months. Now, now we're going to start going over the, the zones for our spring 2021 overall weather forecast, which will be our first official we're gonna go west to east. Stormy. We're gonna start with the this green region in the northwestern United States. We will be seeing some, um, wet pattern in some time in the spring, and for portions of the Pacific Northwest, and it will be and thus was labeled stormy. Now, due to in the, in the Southwest, due to warm and dry conditions ex- anticipated for the spring. There may be renewed drought concerns in the area and maybe and will be and there will be some wildfires. But I don't think it'll be as bad as twenty twenty season was. Mountain snow will still be possible for the Rocky Mountains in 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 the early to late spring, especially the early spring because it is obviously gonna be colder by then. But once we get warmer in late spring, some high elevation, some of the higher peaks could still be seeing some snow. So that is not really a ruled out. In the north, in the upper Midwest, in portions of the far northern U.S., we will be seeing an early period of of cold weather. So winter may be lingering around still for these regions. And so this is really important to watch. The region in in the Midwest and northern central plains could be dealing with some flip flop weather. That means we may be seeing dry and hu- warm weather and humid and and severe weather at the at the next point. Okay, so now the cent- now we're gonna go to the central U.S. with in the southern plains, which is where we could be seeing some mild and dry conditions early, becoming stormy late. Now, I do anticipate that some severe weather will also be happening in, across central and eastern U.S. So this region, this zone that I have the highest confidence may have some severe weather, Here, aside from all the, the dry potential and as well as where it will be in closer to normal precipitation. It goes all the way from the Gulf Coast to the Great Lakes region, 
and and where we'll be seeing above normal precipitation or near normal precipitation. Now we're going to go to the southeast where we're going to be expecting some abnormal heat. Heat, so this is really something we got to you know, watch, especially as we are still really uncertain with what's going to happen in the spring. And we have inched a month clo and a half closer since the last outlook, which is almost two months ago, actually. Now the final forecast zone will be in the northeast with pleasant and warm conditions expected. It rather than very stormy conditions, but this is really, so this is really going to be a peaceful spring, at least for a part of it, for areas along the east coast, coast from from North Carolina all northward. So this, so major cities like Washington, New York City, and Boston could be, be dealing with warm, pleasant weather before they may get begin storms begin to occur in the summer for those regions and and there could be some tropical cyclones in the Atlantic that may affect the area as because they're along the east coast and you know some hurricanes during the peak are still hurricanes and at the latitude of all the way to Boston perhaps.